was lit. Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy ACO Official back today with another unboxing and fit review. Um, actually, I lied, it's not a fit review, it's just an unboxing. On the left, we've got the Valentino Untitled 11s, and then on the right, we've got Gucci Ace sneakers. I will be doing a real versus fake authentication guide on both of these shoes just because I keep getting asked loads and loads of questions about these. So, firstly, I don't know if this is probably a seasonal thing, but with all the Gucci stuff, now you get this sick bag. Normally, it's just a, it's the same as this, but it's white and the writing's black, but obviously they're doing this now, which is a pretty nice addition. Buying direct from Gucci, you always get these. One of them's got like the receipt in it. One of them just saying thank you for purchasing, that's this one. And then this is just some random leaflet thing. I don't really know what's inside it. This is all UK, by the way. I don't know if it's the same in America. And you've got your two dust bag here. Perfect embroidery, perfect stitching, nice material. And then obviously inside you've got the trainers here. So these are obviously a bit different to the ones I showed you previously. A few months ago I did one on the Gucci Snake version of these Aces. I kind of like this one, it's a bit more casual. Um, the difference with this one is if you look on the back here, you've got this kind of crocodile effect. Sometimes the ones with the animals on them, like the bee, the snakes, they're just a bit too much. Like sometimes you just want something normal. So these are quite good for that. Retail price on these is £410. On the ones which are embroidered with loads of different animals, they kind of range. So some of them go up to like £460. I think some of them are also close to £500 as well. But um, yeah, they do vary quite a lot in price. If you want to see them on foot, do check the fit review I did on the Gucci t-shirt and the other version of the A sneakers. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it on these. They're just nice, simple trainers. The leather's really soft, nice white colour. Going to be a bit of a pain to keep clean and they do crease quite easily. So do look out for that. But if you've been wanting to get them um, and it's around Christmas time or Boxing Day now, the sales and stuff, definitely look into them, see what you can find. But yeah, that's enough on the Aces. So on to the Valentinos. So open the box up straight away. There's these two little envelopes and then you've got spare laces here. Once again, you've got um, your dust bag. You pretty much get these with any designer item. And then in here, you've got the shoes. So yeah, here you can have a quick look, just an overall look. You can see they stand out a lot. Um, when I went to go pick these up from the store, these aren't mine by the way, they're like women's shoes. But when I went to go pick them up, um, I saw someone wearing them and like, it's not even a thing where you're looking, like you're purposely looking at what people are wearing, but they stand out so much that your eyes just get drawn to them. And because of these studs as well, like when someone's wearing them outside and it's sunny, like you literally, your eyes just get attracted to them. You can get these in men's version as well and they look basically the same. You've got the rock stud, untitled, studs mad on these and then you've got that rock stud finishing around the corners and the back just have an overall look at them going into the details more on this one the price is 500 pounds they do range though i've seen them from up to 550 to 500 if i'm doing a comparison against the gucci trainers they are more expensive but the ones with the studs are definitely a lot more eye-catching and the other thing with Gucci stuff is now it's a bit played out, like not played out, but so many people have them, like it's just a common thing now. Before I wrap up this video, question of the day, let me know which pair you prefer, the Valentinos on the left or the Gucci's on the right, comment down below. Questions, you can just leave them down below in the comments as well. Look out for the authentication guides on both of these shoes. As always, hope the video was helpful and I'll see you guys again on the next video. Peace.